Hey guys, hello everyone and welcome to the channel. So this video is regarding a uh, notification or job notification by uh, RAC. RAC is basically recruitment and assessment center from DRDO. So this job is DRDO like the job you have to serve for DRDO and this is scientist position B or scientist B position job. Okay. So uh, this video uh, is all about this particular uh, recruitment that what are the eligibility criteria, how you can apply, uh, what is the fees, what is the dates, everything I'm going to discuss in this video. Uh, so what I have right now over here is the official website of RAC. I'll give you link or to reach out to this particular website directly in the description of this video. So you can come up over here directly. Now all you have to do is you have to go to this latest section over here and you have to scroll down a little bit and here you will see advertisement number 140 that is for scientist B recruitment okay now this is published on 23rd of June and uh, last updated on 23rd of June itself uh, there is uh, like this is the button from where or this is the link from where you can download the advertisement and read about it in detail so uh, I, I have already downloaded and I have highlighted the important points from there I'll tell you that what are the things and how you can apply for that okay so if you click on this you'll be able to download the same advertisement now let me take you to the advertisement and show you so this is how the advertisement looks uh, recruitment and assessment center uh, RAC and this is direct recruitment for the post of scientist B in DRDO there are 630 total vacancies so there's a big number of vacancies which are there and uh, uh, for chemistry it is especially there there are for lot of subjects but i'm going to talk about chemistry as per because our channel resonates with the chemistry students so we will talk about chemistry itself right so as i said this is scientist b position job for drdo and this is online application so that's what it is said the closing date of this online application is 21 days from the activation of the link now activation of the link has not happened yet i'll show you once again this official website if you see there is only adverti view advertisement button there is no uh, like option to apply right just like uh, for the other uh, positions you will get apply online thing but for this you will not get okay there is no option to apply till now so that's why i'm expecting it to come in next one or two days so the time when i'm recording this there is no apply online uh, option which has arrived but it will come since the application has uh, or the advertisement is announced on 23rd of june so within a week it is going to come and you have to apply using that particular button and the process is super simple one more thing that you have to keep on checking the official website so that you don't miss out this application right okay now this is a very good opportunity to apply in drdo and get a handsome handsome salary in your pocket okay uh, so if you see here it says it's uh, the job or the the position scientist b position which you are going to get is going to pay you a matrix sum of 56100 and in the speci uh, specified disciplines and categories uh, total emoluments if you ch check about like including hra and other alliance it will be roughly around 88000 per month so it's a big amount in the metro cities that much amount you are going to get paid uh, if you get selected in this particular post now this is the website uh, where all these informations are there i'll give you all the link in the description so you can go directly i'll directly go to the uh, like i'll go directly go to the place where chemistry is being expressed so uh, the overall uh, like advertisement is dis is divided into two parts part one and part two so this is part two where chemistry comes so chemistry over here you can see it comes in part two of this uh, whole uh, application process and here you can see that uh, this is this chemistry like for the chemistry exam uh, it is organized by drdu and these are the total number of vacancies which they have so there are 25 total vacancies out of those 25 9 are in unreserved category 3 are in ews category 6 in obc category then 4 in sc category and 3 in st category so this is how all 25 seats are divided over here uh, let's talk about the essential qualification so the essential qualification requires at least first class in masters in chemistry from recognized university or equivalent and the second necessary qualification is that you should have a valid gate score in chemistry cy subject now 
uh, this particular post is uh, and especially whatever subjects are mentioned in part 2 these are based only on gate score they are only based on gate score and personal interview there will be no written exam for these exams so for chemistry also you can apply only and only through your gate score once you will get shortlisted based upon your gate score then you can apply uh, for personal interview like you will be called for the personal interview right so be it any discipline general chemistry organic inorganic analytical physical applied any chemistry you can apply for this particular position let's come a little down for other informations so here are the eligibility criteria so as i already mentioned that the eligibility requires uh, and also we will talk about part two because that's where chemistry exists uh, in the uh, whole uh, advertisement so it says candidate should possess uh, the requisite essential qualification along with a valid uh, gate qualified scorecard uh, then uh, the age limit is for unreserved category it's 28 years for obc it's 31 years for scst candidates it's 33 years relaxation will be given on the upper age limit as per the government rules coming a little down how you have to apply so as i said apply online option is not yet arrived on this website it will be updated in next few days so keep checking this website so that you can apply on time let's come a little down so we have a list of documents which are needed to be uploaded while filling up the form so you need self-attested certificates or self-attested documents including all the basic eligibility doc documents including your 10th uh, mark sheet then your uh, like bachelor's mark sheet your master's mark sheet if you belong to a particular category then uh, your ews cat uh, certificate or obc certificate is going to be asked so whatever documents are necessary they all will be asked uh, to be uploaded uh, you will also have to upload uh, uh, like if if there is some mismatch in your name and also those things are mentioned over here that is not for everyone if there is some mismatch in your name and the certificate in that case you have to put, uh, put affidavit and all okay recent passport size photograph is required i scanned sample of candidate signature that means your signature valid gate score is required now this is uh, for applicable only for category one candidates in part one discipline and for all the candidates in part two discipline part two uh, was having chemistry so for chemistry you should have a valid gate score valid gate score means the gate score which you have should be valid for this time and then you can apply okay then application fees and mode of payment so for general category and ews category and obc category male candidates they have to pay 100 rupees while applying for this particular form whereas there is no application fees for scst pwd and women candidates so they don't have to pay anything they can simply apply for this okay um, so that is about the fees payment okay that means how much amount you have to pay as the application fees then let's come over here a little bit for subject disciplines under part 2 eligible candidates will be shortlisted okay so this is the process how you will be shortlisted so eligible candidates will be shortlisted for personal interview on the basis of their gate score in the ratio of 1 is to 5 1 is to 5 means for each one seat 5 will be like 5 people will be called for the interview so if there are 25 seats so they are going to call uh, 125 students for the interview okay so that's what they are telling uh, subject to their availability in the or, uh, in order of discipline wise uh, category wise merit list okay so that's what they have mentioned okay written exam is not going to be conducted for chemistry so that part is not for you selection process let's see so the shortlisted candidates on the basis of gate score or written exam which chemistry people don't have to give so on the basis of gate score will be required to appear for the personal interview to be held at delhi or any other place as uh, decided by RAC and DRDO. The offer of appointment to the candidate will be uh, restricted to the number of vacancies. So what they are telling is basically uh, once you will be shortlisted for uh, from your gate score, you will be called for personal interview. Once you qualify the personal interview, then offer letter will be given to you and the final result will be uploaded on the RAC website. Okay. Uh, next, we have a selection criteria. So the how they are going to select so for subject discipline under part two that is for chemistry the final selection of the candidate will be purely on the basis of discipline wise category wise merit list of aggregate of 80 percent weightage of gate score and 20 percent weightage marks for the personal interview so the final list which will be made will will include 80 percent weightage from your gate score 
and 20% weightage from your personal interview. Now, there is no cutoff which they have mentioned that this much gate score you need to apply. Uh, basically, anybody who has qualified gate exam, that person can apply and that can like fill the form. But as you can see that the weightage for the gate score is so high. So definitely those who have higher gate scores or those who have good gate rank, they have high chances of getting selection selected and uh, like they will be called for the personal interview. Uh, so if your rank is good, if you feel confident enough that yes, that much rank is enough and I can apply, you should go for it. There is no restriction. Even the one who has just qualified gate that can also apply. That person can also apply. But uh, the person who is having good gate score that is only going to be called upon. Okay. Now let's come a little down over here. So the closing date is again mentioned that the online closing date uh, will be 21 days from the activation of the link. So link is not activated yet. Till the time I'm recording this video, the link is not activated. Once the link will act get activated, after that uh, 21 days, up till 21 days, this form will stay. So uh, like keep checking the official website so that you don't miss out this form. If you have a good gate score and if you think that this job is for you and you should apply for it, definitely you should go for this. This is one of the best options which you can get after having a good gate score and uh, that's what it is. So that's all from my side for this particular video. Uh, once the application form will come and if there will be any problem in filling the form, I'll make a dedicated video on that. Although I believe that the form filling is very simple. You don't have to worry about that much. So it's pretty simple process. Just two, three pages will be there and it will be very easily filled. Just basic information will be asked. So that's it from my side for this particular video. I hope you guys understood. Uh, there are some other general instructions and uh, caution. So I'll suggest you to download this advertisement and please do go through this properly so that you don't miss out any point. All the major points I have informed you although and that's what it is all about. So that's all from my side. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next one. Till then have a great day. Bye bye. Take care. Hey guys. So I teach live on Unacademy Plus platform. Here I teach for the CSIR UGC net category and you can follow me over here for regular classes. You can access my free classes as well as my paid classes on this particular platform. The classes which are free, you can get that under the section of special classes. Whereas in order to access my paid classes, paid live classes, we have to take an Academy plus subscription. So do make sure that you take the an Academy plus subscription to access all my paid classes which are quite organized. The whole syllabus is being completed over there and the classes are quite regular over there. So make sure that you take an Academy plus subscription by using my referral code that is N underscore Huda. That's it for this. Thank you so much.